No chill, and there is no filter. That's what's up. No chill, no filter. What's poppin', what's poppin', and what is poppin' again, y'all? This your big homie MC Ron Ski. Not like y'all didn't know that. I'm here to talk about it, man. The Nemesis card for the UBL Battle League Universal. I do, no, I'm sorry. That's not Universal. That's Queen reaching them over there in Peoria. This is Underground Battle League. And uh, I must say, G. Gray, shout out, brother, because you definitely putting on for the whole Midwest. Appreciate you, man. You're doing your thing, dog. So, this is a prediction vlog, of course. For um, the Nemesis card, I got a couple people that I'm going to be training in. So, you know, once I get them all situated, then y'all won't be seeing this ugly ass mug again. I'll just be behind the cameras. And that's what I want to be, behind the camera, not in front of it. Okay, here we go. We're going to go ahead and knock this down, man. We got Lady Loyalty. She's going to be doing her thing, you know what I'm saying, with all that yammage in the building. Uh, my man Jay Lopez is going to be like pretty much a impromptu birthday type deal for him although his birthday is the following week so you know no real big deal we're gonna be in the house we're gonna be putting on for my mans and them all right first things first man i guess they got like a, a main event type card and then they have an undercard so we're gonna do the undercard first man and i'm gonna start from the very last up to the very first scotty lyrical versus fat folks man Scotty Lyrical versus Fat Folks. You know, that Fat Folks reached out to me, man. And I was, I was, I was, uh, I'm going to say deeply moved by, you know, him hitting me up, man, and saying what it is that he said. He wanted to, you know, let me know that he was going to cook tomorrow. I'm thinking that, uh, I don't know. I don't know. I, I, I'm going to leave that up in the air. I ain't going to say who going to do what. I do know that a Focus Scotty Lyrical and a Focus Fat Folks, okay, I'm going to say STP, a STP Scotty Lyrical and a Great Britain Fat Folks, that's going to be a decent battle. That's that, That'll be a decent battle. Um, but any choking, man, y'all know, man, I'm, a, I'm roasting. I'm roasting on chokes from now on, for real. Y'all y'all becoming, man, and, and y'all do understand that, you know, folks is paying to get in these events, man, and they paying battle rappers, and they paying folks trips to get here, and all this old type of stuff, man, and y'all get up on stage and choke, y'all got to stop that, man. Okay, J Major versus uh, uh, County Line. I don't know. I'm going to say J Major. Uh, Greedy versus Don Wees. Hmm, man. I, 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 don't, I mean, honestly, you know, that. I guess y'all going to have to leave that one up to y'all. Because uh, really, I don't really know neither one of them. I have heard of Don Wees, never heard of Greedy. But I'm pretty sure once I get in the building and I see people, I'm like, oh, yeah, right, 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 I saw your battle. But, you know, I'm really bad with names. I don't know, I already told y'all that. But it is what it is. G. Gray versus... <sighs> Man, I, I just, I hate seeing dude name because I don't know how to really pronounce it. Like, Lyricologist, we just gonna leave it at that. Lyricologist versus G. Gray. I got G. Gray cooking, dude, off top. I ain't, that's not even, that's not even a, I'm not even... We ain't got to go there. You know what I mean? G. Gray is way too hard for dude. I done seen dude battle before, and I just, I don't think, I don't think dude got nothing coming, man. For real, for real. G. Gray, don't have me eating my words, man, on my recap. Rich Porter versus T. The Stamp God. I got Rich Porter. I got Rich Porter taking Nats. Um... We go Larry Bull versus Steezy. You know what, Steezy? My bad, fam. I was supposed to have hollered at you, fam, um, and I did not. I didn't get back with you, man. I, I, I'm a, I'm a inbox you, dog. I'm a inbox you. Um, but Larry Bull versus Steezy. Larry Bull got a whole lot of energy, man. A whole lot of energy, man. And Steezy got some fire bars. So once again, both of them on focus mode. I got that being a, a decent battle. But who would I edge it to? Versus Larry Bull versus Steezy. I like Steezy swag and I like Larry Bull's energy. So both of the young homies is pretty dope. And I really just I'm I'm sick of having to pick between two of the young homies though. Why can't be somebody from out of town? So you know what? If I really had to pick, man, I would have to say <sighs> I had to say Larry Bull because Larry Bull is not like a big time like you know because I I've seen Steezy like. 
at his worst, but I also seen him at his best. So a focus easy is definitely going to be, you know, all, all good, man. But I would edge that over to Larry Bull. Shooter versus Jay Savage. I got Shooter. Um, Hoodlum versus Vex. Y'all ready for some more hood type stuff, man? The viral villain is going to be in the building. I wish I was recording that so I can do some quick clips on this dude. But I won't be recording that. But other other than that, man, I got Hoodlum taking that, man. 100%. Buck versus Emery Forbes. These names is crazy, man. But, of course, I got Buck doing that. So, is this... This is this is Uptown Buck, not Maserati Buck. I, it don't say which one it is, but I'm sure it's going to be... It's going to be the point guard Buck. You know what I mean? Okay, so that was my prediction, man. I got Buck winning that, Emory Forbes. I love Buck, man. Uptown Buck, man, that dude got some serious swag about himself. I love the way his, I love his delivery. I love his performance. I just, everything dude do, I just, I'm, 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 I'm on Team Buck. You know what I mean? I'm, I'm Team Buck today. So, you know what? Like I said, once again, man, shout out UBL. Shout out my man, uh, Jay Lopez, G. Gray, you're putting on for the Midwest, man. I definitely appreciate everything that you're doing. Thanks for, you know, giving me my press pass so I can get in, check out everything, man. You know what I'm saying? You already know I'm going to bring you them dope recaps. I'm going to bring you them little clips. Um, I will be in the, in the building with my camera also. Won't be, you know, exposing any of your stuff. You know, you already know what I do, man. So, in any event, man, I definitely appreciate you. Once again, that battle is going to be taking place at the End Zone Barbershop, 3607 North MLK Drive, Milwaukee, Wisconsin. Make sure y'all get there, man. As a matter of fact, the doors open. Oh, man. Okay. Oh, yeah. There we go. There we go. Okay. The doors open. Wait a minute. Before 830. It started at 830? Whew. That's late. That's pretty late. That's kind of late. But okay, I'll be turned up by then, so I might just be falling in that demonstration, man, instead of just walking in. But yeah, yeah, slap squat, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. So in any event, man, this is Big Homie MC Ronski. No chill, no filter TV in the building. Look, I'm hoping everybody, you know what I'm saying, is enjoying this heat. Be careful, man. Stay hydrated, man. Stay cool. And if you if you have to, man, if you if you absolutely have to go outside, make sure, man, you take the proper steps, man. Stay hydrated. You know what I'm saying? Wear suntan lotion, you know, sunblock and all that old good stuff, man, and keep yourself safe. All right, man. Once again, this is Big Homie. MC Ron Skeeters. No chill, no filter TV. And I'm about this bitch. Peace.